Hi everyone. I found this three pack of shelf sitters from Target in the dollar spot. The scrapbook paper I got from Hobby Lobby. I tried to line up some of the wording in the center of two of the stars. Trace the stars with a pencil and then cut those out. For the third one, I traced it out on the distressed red, white, and blue stripe paper. To adhere the paper to the stars, I used matte finish Mod Podge, did a thin but even layer across the back side of each of the stars, and let that dry. To get a smooth finish on the paper, I'm going to be using the iron method. This little iron I got from Walmart. I set it to the highest setting that is not on steam. Place the paper onto the wood, then use parchment paper, not wax paper. Place it over the star and iron the paper down. What this does is it reactivates the Mod Podge underneath and adheres the paper to the wood surface. After I finished ironing, I took a piece of 60 grit sandpaper and sanded off the edges of any of the paper that was left over. It comes off fairly easy. If you find some of the edges are lifting a little bit, just add a little more Mod Podge underneath and smooth it down. Let that dry and then continue sanding. With the Mod Podge dry under the paper, I added more to the top to give it a final seal. I did notice some rippling in the paper and that's okay. I was able to smooth it out with my finger very gently so I didn't rip the paper. With that dry, I decided to distress them with Waverly Antique Wax. I simply dipped my finger in the wax and rubbed it all over the paper and edges of the stars. And there you go, some cute 4th of July shelf sitters. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like this video and you can always follow my page at Jenny of All Trades. Thanks for watching, stay crafty, and we'll see you soon. Take care. Bye.